the title of the video says it all. I did not title this video, there is money to be made during a down market. I did not title this video, you can make fantastic returns during the bear cycle. No, millionaires are made. Let that sink in. Millionaires are made. Hell, billionaires are made. But I know for many of us, even becoming a millionaire seems so astronomically out there, we couldn't possibly even imagine it, let alone have the conviction and the patience to let that dream come true. Well, let me tell you this. I personally know people who have made tens of millions of dollars by doing just this. These are average Joes. I'm not talking about people who, have, who, who started with huge amounts of capital. I'm talking about people like you and I who had the patience and the conviction, who got into these projects early during prime buying season when everything's at a discount and then had the conviction and the patience to wait at a much better opportunity further down the line when the whole world is in crazy crypto mode again to realize their gains. Now, let me tell you this. It is very feasible. It is realistic. It's, it's a realistic expectation, which sounds crazy to say, that you can start with as little as $10,000 in the market and turn that into a million dollars plus. People have done far better than that. But by making intelligent strategic decisions now, that is very much a possibility. If you don't have $10,000, I don't care if you are the oldest person in the world, the youngest, there, is, there are ways to make money. Get a paper route, get anything. There was a quote that I'll, I'll mention here that has meant a lot to me over the years and has proven true time and time again for myself. And that is, live like most people won't, so you can live like most people can't. That's a pretty powerful message. And essentially in this situation, it means make the cutbacks you need to make. Pick up the extra part-time job that you need to pick up. Start dollar cost averaging as much as you can or as little as you can every single week, every single month to set your positions. That's all it takes. Cut back on the creature comforts if you need to. Couple less coffees a week, less takeouts. You know, you, I'm not going to bore you with all the ways in which you can save money, but ultimately it could be one of the best decisions you ever make. And it's not exactly something that you need to be doing for the next couple of get decades if you play your hand correctly now before the bull cycle comes around. There are so many opportunities, not just new projects and new technologies that are coming out, which there will be plenty specifically in some of these new arenas like AI, for instance, and the whole metaverse footprint expanding and expanding. There are existing products out there, stuff that still has valuable use cases, stuff that has been you know, attracting consistent institutional interest, and therefore the trust factor should only be growing for some of those projects that haven't been rug pulls, that have been around and do intend to forge a path forward into this, this next bull market as well. For me, Hex is one of those. Hex is certainly one of those. We've talked about the various catalysts that are taking place with Testnet V3. We've talked about, you know, the Pulse chain and the PulseX ecosystem that will no doubt be like a steroid injection into Hex. Um, we also have the copy, the big airdrop that's going to get you a copy of your Hex. If you want to streamline the learning curve, and again, I am not a financial advisor. I'm just looking through the lens that I have of somewhat experience within the crypto sector and certainly my own personal take on things. Getting into Hex, if you wanted to streamline it, you didn't want to do so much of your own due diligence, which you always should, and research, that could be a safe bet for a lot of people. There are obviously going to be other projects that we're talking about. Like I said, I'm not going to touch on some of these until I personally plan to either put more or invest for the first time into some of these, just so I'm coming from a place that isn't, you know, isn't just me capitalizing on decisions that others are making. Um, I want to be in a position where I'm also on that journey as well. But let this serve as a reminder. This should be a massive reminder to a lot of us who already know the rules, but need a bit, in the, a bit of a kick up the ass to reinvigorate that dollar cost averaging, right? Sometimes, you know, it, it, it takes constant vigilance to consistently put money aside. Even if you haven't made a decision to get into any specific projects, what you should be doing right now is taking the fiat currency that you're making, that you have left over and that you feel like you want to invest, using one of the exchanges like a Coinbase or a Binance to start accumulating some stable coins, like a Tether, like a USDC, which ultimately will cut down the amount of time it's going to take for you to pull the trigger when you want. But most importantly, a lot of these DEXs will take, you know, a week or two sometimes to clear funds to get everything set up so that you're, especially if you're brand new to crypto, 
you want to start that process as soon as possible. And of course, as we've talked about, transfer those funds over to your own private wallet, like a MetaMask, and just start accumulating. Start accumulating as soon as you can so that when it does come to make that decision, when you do think it is a prime opportunity to invest, then there's nothing holding you back from doing so. You're not limited by the time it's going to take you to get in. That's one of the best advices I could give you right now. I've been in the situation many a time where I've wanted to jump on something, but yet it's taken me time to transfer funds and I missed out on half of that opportunity. But for all of us watching now, there are astronomical amounts of money to be made when you're making intelligent, strategic decisions. There is so much content out there. Again, even if you're brand new, watching channels like this, watching other channels that act as a, a fast track to education, educating yourself right now is going to make things so much better in the future. You can have such an advantage of everyone jumping on the emotional bandwagon when the whole world is crypto crazy again. When you've already learned the stuff that you need to learn, when you've already become far more experienced, you've already gained a lot of the knowledge you're going to need to make intelligent decisions when that time comes. Not to mention, you've already set up a lot of your positions by the time that time comes anyway. So hopefully you're already sat on a big fat stack of tokens and your your whole worldview changes. Now it's just, you know, when do I take profits? Which projects do I see going longer term? What are going to off, uh, offer opportunities for passive and residual income going forward? These are all conversation topics that we can get into as well. But right now, right now is the time to accumulate. I can't say that strongly enough. And anyone watching this video now that doesn't take those actions now, I can almost guarantee that by the time that bull market comes around, you're going to be kicking yourself. I'm going to remind you when this time comes around too. So let this be a reminder. If you want to make probably larger gains than you can make anywhere else right now, barring a few variables personally that you know you may have opportunities that just are too good to be true, for the majority of us, we're still very early to crypto. I talked about in a previous video how, how you know, after tennis the other day, I was out to, to lunch with a few folks who do have quite a bit of money. They all come from you know, big professional backgrounds and they're still scared of crypto. It was fantastic to hear because it tells me that we're still early. When you hear people around you that you otherwise wouldn't suspect of having any crypto knowledge talking about Bitcoin and Ethereum again, that's the time you should be getting close to thinking it could be a good exit opportunity because chances are by then we've seen so much price appreciation that every man and his dog is back in the crypto game. Act now before that. I know it sounds obvious and certainly for a lot of us who have been in the market for a while, who've already experienced some of these big gains, we've done this. We're, do we're automatically doing this. We're already attuned to what it takes. The recipe to success is there. There is a blueprint and I'm telling you right now, I have personally seen this blueprint play out. I've seen it play out to a much larger extent with people that I know. And so I'm acting now. I now am using this upcoming bull cycle to make some huge money. And you don't need to start with a huge bag to begin with. You just need to be strategic with the money you're making, be dedicated and committing to putting away money, either automatically or consciously set reminders for yourself every week, every month after you get paid to start making these decisions now so that when we do reach a year, two years down the road, we're in a very, very different situation. We're glad we made those early sacrifices. So I hope this helped. Um, please, again, if you've stayed till the end, I can't thank you enough. This channel has only been around for a few weeks and we're almost at a thousand already in subs. So please do sub, please subscribe. I'll be putting out some more content as time goes forward. As I say, also, um, we will be talking about some of the projects that I intend to get into or that I'm already in, but want to put more money in. I want to be as unbiased as I can with a lot of this stuff. I also want to ride the journey with this community as well for anything that I'm quote unquote recommending or suggesting that I take a part of. Um, so stay tuned. Thank you again. It's been fantastic reading your comments and I absolutely love the feedback and the community that we're building here. Um, stay tuned. Thanks again, guys.